Hey, good afternoon. We've got Merle. Merle had surgery with me um, about five years ago, and uh, we did an operation on her back, and everything's gone very well. But lately, Merle's been describing. You tell us what you've been describing, Merle. Um, burning in the front of my legs, my feet. Burning and shows your feet. Okay, looks pretty normal. And, and also, the tops of my legs are very weak. When very. I walk, I feel as though my legs are going to break. Yep. Do you have any Top. tenderness in the muscles when you push on them? Yes, a little bit. A of little tenderness. bit of tenderness yeah. there too. Yeah. And Merle um, has been taking. How long have you been taking Crestor for? I would say about three years, or could even possibly be a little bit more. And can you remember why you were given that prescription? By your well, doctor. I think I had a blood test and they said my cholesterol was up and mm -hmm. they put me on to Crestor. Yep. Did, um, did the doctor tell you what the problem was with your cholesterol no. being up or, no, or how say, up the cholesterol was? No, he just mm. said it was up and for me to go on to Crestor. Yep. Now, um, we've investigated, investigated Merle's uh spine with an mri scan and we can see that the surgery's been performed there's no complications with the surgery and uh my belief is that merle's uh, symptoms are due to the um the effects that crestor has on the muscle and the nerves so i think that you're a classic presentation of what we call statin myopathy and peripheral neuropathy and uh, there is really very very little clinical indication for you to be on Crestor. You've not had a heart attack, you've not had a stroke, you have no high risk factors for any of those cardiovascular disease, no. cardiovascular diseases and the, the consumption of cholesterol is of no benefit to you and a significant risk to those side effects. Mm -hmm of statin myopathy and peripheral neuropathy and um, hopefully when we cease the uh, medication those symptoms will subside mm -hmm. um, uh, but we'll we'll see okay thanks mel